www.thebarbellgirl.com and today I'm going to show you how incredibly easy it is to reupholster a chair. So let's get started. Go ahead and flip your chair upside down and locate the four holes under your chair and go ahead and remove the screws. Go ahead and set your chair aside and then we're going to go ahead and reupholster the seat. You can use the 5-in-1 tool to get underneath the staples and pry them up. Or you can use needle nose pliers to pry up the old fabric and staples. After you've cut out the new cover, start by stapling it on the center of the top and the bottom. Pulling it tight. And then repeat for the two sides. Check to make sure that it's taut and then continue stapling along the bottom of the chair. Once you get to the corner you want to staple in as far as you can and then you want to slowly pull and tuck your corners and trying to eliminate any of the pleats. The back of the chair has an L-shaped cutout. And to upholster this, what I'm going to do is I'm going to push the seam in the center and pull it real tight right there and put a staple in the middle. Then I'm going to individually pull each side out to the side to make it really fit tight around that corner. When you flip your seat over you can see you've got a really nice upholstered seat and you don't see a lot of pleats on the front and that's your main goal. I've, I've put this chair right side up and I'm going to put the seat that I need to attach on top of the other one and position it so that I have something to push against when I screw the screws back in. As you can see, reupholstering a chair is a really easy DIY project and it's a great way to give your chair an instant facelift. I hope you'll come to my blog and read more DIY tutorials at prettyhandygirl.com.